This is your fault. You, you chose this path. Taste of blood. It's murder. Was it worth it? This is your fault. You you chose this path. Hey guys. Hey Ushatak, why are you playing Armor 2? That's some that's some bullshit right there. Well, if you look over here, it says days. I'm playing a mod. I explicitly bought this game yesterday just for this mod. It is a zombie mod, and it is goddamn awesome. <clears throat> your character is persistent across servers, incredibly realistic, you lose your shit when you die. Well, it's incredibly realistic within reason. Like, there's some shit that's not realistic, but that's just how it is. Wow, this server supports 60. I'm gonna try and find a good server with low ping that, uh... Let's see, Atlanta, Atlanta. I don't remember if those are good or not. I do remember that the ones hosted by a guy that I'm not seeing now, Taw Tonic, this guy, that those ones were really good. This one doesn't have that many people in it comparatively, but I'm still gonna go to this one, because <coughs> I know it'll be set up correctly. All these servers seem to be capped at around 150 zombies, maybe a little bit more. Like, I was on one yesterday, and it peaked at 186, most of the time it was at 150 or lower. And this game has a 220-something kilometer, square kilometer that is, of course, map, which is fucking enormous. So, 150 zombies over that much space is like, <laughs> one zombie every six miles, it's kind of stupid. <clears throat> Usually there's like five or six hundred, which is like two or three zombies every for every square kilometer. Not that they're in every square kilometer, it's focused in cities and stuff, which is how it should be. Also, you probably notice that the sound may be a little bit echoey. I'm going to turn off the music sounds when I get in. <clears throat> now, this this also will take a long time to load. But, um, I will be editing this, so you won't have to watch that. Anyway, You'll probably notice that the music will echo a bit, and that's because I'm playing with speakers. I am just way too lazy to put headphones on. Plus, it is fucking hot, and I... that, that makes it worse. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> now we received a mission fire. Here's where I'm going to cut, and uh, we'll be back when it's done loading. This is the point in the loading where it gets stuck, like, forever. Um, anyway, I just resumed recording to let you guys know that the sound for the game is quite quiet in the audio settings -y thing, so I don't need to turn off the music or worry about that. You guys will be able to hear some stuff, but uh, primarily you'll be hearing me. Anyway, uh, back to the waiting. Fucking session lost. I will be back when I get one that works. Alright, it's finally fucking done. I've been waiting for like 20 minutes because apparently the login server is overloaded. Alright. So, zombie game. <clears throat> this is a brand new character because I died. Um, this isn't where you spawn. I spawned down the tracks someplace. But I have nothing yet. Alright, so on the bottom right you'll see I have a food, blood, and water meter. And then some random icon with a face that I don't understand. So, I'm low on food and water. But not low enough that I want to take food yet. But I think I'll drink some water. for my inventories. I found a bunch of baked beans yesterday. And in here, I think I have... I have another water bottle in there. I'm gonna move... I'm gonna move, uh, something. I'll move one of these morphines into the pack and take this water bottle out. Alright. Stand up. C is stand up, X is crouch, and, uh, Z is prone. For those of you who are trying to figure this game out. V does that. Middle click does a lot of shit. Brings up a menu in the middle left. <coughs> which is, uh... Which is cool once you get used to it. Before you get used to it. Confuses the hell out of you. Because it changes constantly in context. Alright, now I can fill my, uh... My other water thing I just used. That's nice. <coughs> Alright. I'm looking for something to loot. I need a primary weapon. And I also need other stuff. It says Pochta. 
and that says Respia Respulia Chernarus Gorduma. Why is there an S? That's a different form of acrylic than I'm used to then. I don't know what that means, so I don't know what this is. Hopefully there's stuff though. Not looking like it. Either it's been looted or just nothing spawned here. Loot respawns very slowly, so... Eventually there will be more shit to find, otherwise everyone would find all the shit and then everyone would just starve because you're closed into a certain area of the map. Like the 220 whatever kilometers. Which is a lot, but over time you'd still use it all up. There's something in here. Nope. Let's head over there. On the top right you'll see a little debug area with stats. All of which are at the fault for me because I just started this guy. <coughs> That debug screen is because this mod is an alpha. Oh look, some dead zombie. With no items. There might be stuff in here. That was opening and closing this door. I want to open this one. Maybe it doesn't open. I know this. Oh, there it goes. Nothing here. That sucks. <coughs> I'll look over here. Anything in here? Yes. What is vest pouch? Nothing in it. And I could switch bags, but that one's actually smaller than what you start with. Start with one that holds like ten, I believe. I think. Let me make sure. Eight. Either way, more than six. <clears throat> I'm gonna head out this way. I'm gonna go in that road. It's getting dark. That's uh, interesting. I haven't experienced nighttime in this game. If I didn't make it clear, this uh, mod is called Daisy as one word. <clears throat> Which obviously stands for like zombie. The Z. Let's see what we find up this road. <clears throat> Whole hell of a lot of this game is just waiting for shit to happen and or traveling, which honestly is a lot of what would happen in the real world. Ooh, doo -doo -doo. Roads always lead to something. There's bound to be like a little outposty settlement thing. At some point, Yesterday I found a barn that had like five guns, three crossbows, some with, one of them had two bolts, a sniper rifle with a bunch of clips, and an Einfeld rifle with a bunch of clips. <clears throat> that was uh, pretty cool. Hoping to find that place again sometime. There's some wood, and there's one building. I don't, don't know if that's something you can go inside, which unfortunately you can't go inside all the buildings, at least not yet. I'm hoping that that's something that they're going to add. More buildings with interiors and stuff like that.
Hmm. I don't think you can get in there, but there is a little boothy thing in the front. <clears throat> Hopefully there's some items in there. Zombies or anything. Yep, can't open it. Oh, there is loot, but it sucks ass. It's empty cans and shit. Fantastic. <clears throat> hmm. Keep going up the road. I may, if I'm not lazy, edit this together to skip a lot of this walking. Because it's seriously boring. Well, for you. It's not that boring for me. Because I'm doing the walking and the navigating and the looking around. People in the bottom left are talking about transfusions for your blood level, which is basically your health. The lower it gets, the more fucked up your character gets with like screen shaking, black and white, falling down if you run too much, etc. But uh, you gotta get pretty low before a lot of that shit happens. Anyway, a transfusion, which apparently you need a second person to do on you, will uh, we'll fix that. And also eating food will, but it only does like 200 per food. Now you can see I have 12,000 blood, so... Needless to say, that doesn't do that much for you. It's better than nothing, though. <clears throat> Blinky shadow glitch. Awesome. In this game, you can do this. Hold Alt. If you double tap Alt, it locks you in that mode. Ah, look, building this. <clears throat> At last. Okay, I think the sun sets in the east. <clears throat> uh, oh, oh. Of course, maybe that's on the uh, other half in the world. It's maybe different, but I, I don't think so. Yeah, it can't be because the world always spins in the same direction, which means east and west are the same. Can I open that? Nope. Nothing here. Pavlovo. In order to get a map in this game, you actually have to find a map, so kind of get lost and wander around a lot until then. So I've never had a map, not yet. I don't think that opens. Nope. Let's turn down the volume a little. Nothing there. There could be something in here. Nope. There's a church. 
I'm not mistaken, zombie nuns and priests and shit frequent there. 